You know, you walk out the door, you see someone that you know, and they ask you how you are, and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. <laughs> Ew, oh my god, look at my eyes. <gasps> hey everyone, what is poppin'? Welcome back to another vlog. My eye, she's getting there, but <laughs> she's still recovering. If you watched my last video, you already know what happened to my eye. I really honestly don't know what happened to my eye. <laughs> it looks like I have a scratch on my retina. It was very light sensitive and also I would have to sit in the dark. I could barely look at my phone. I would have to dim the brightness and just dim the brightness on my computer. I was working all day. I was lacking on doing some work, turning in a video and also I am on my period. <laughs> I'm on my period, my eyes like this. I'm very emotional. I've been crying all morning. That's probably what my eye look like that. It has been very emotional. And when I get my period, I get it hard. I'm very emotional. I want to eat everything on site. <laughs> and I really don't be in the mood to do anything, especially in the first day. The first day, I don't want to do anything. I just, I just want to feel all the period emotions. And today is day three it's getting better so i'm like you know what i need to get myself together i have a little bit of a headache i haven't ate all day actually anyways y'all don't care but i'm just trying to get myself together um i want to go to the store and i want to cook myself a little dinner i want to make a little mocktail it's nine o'clock and i just got done with my video i turned it in <laughs> i'm happy about that i had to make a little drink because i was a little dehydrated i put some Hyaluronic Acid, Pete Life, Beauty Elixir in this poppy. So all I need to really go do is get a fresh cilantro. I want to get some more rosemary to boil on the stove top because I like to put that in my hair in the spray bottle. And then also I just need to get a lime because I'm about to make these beauty tacos that I got from Trader Joe's. Been dying to try these, so I'm just going to let them thaw out while I run to Whole Foods really quick. Tell you to get some onions, cilantro, squeeze the fresh lime. So I wanna do the whole nine to get the full effect of this. So yeah, I'm gonna just throw on some clothes. I really just wanna go like this. And I, this is really how I look on a weekday. If I am on my menstrual cycle, if it's that time in a month, I'm I'm so emotional, it's not even funny. Like crying over nothing. I'm like, I literally be fighting emotional demons. Swear. I'm like, what is wrong with me? Why why am I thinking this way? Or why am I feeling this way? It's so I get to overthinking over the most unnecessary things. And it's just like stop. 
But anyways, let me hurry up before house is closed. We gotta hurry up so I can get back and make my dinner for tonight. Let's head on out. Cheers. Now, I'm applauding myself because I could have really stayed in the bed and just caught it one and not have ate. I could have Uber eat something, but I'm like, you know what? I got food in there. A movie just dropped on Netflix that I wanna watch with Lauren London. Kick back, watch that. Let's go. So I might bake some French toast in the morning. Like I said, y'all, when I'm on my menstrual, when it's at that time of the month, anything goes, okay? These fresh tulips, our arrangement, they put a branch in here. And I thought it was cute just to give my living room some color. I could have just got plain pink tulips, but I'm like, you know what? Let's add a little bit more color. I've been really liking tulips in my living room. They're cute. Then I got these almond flour tortillas. Got a rack of lamb chops. And then I got some fresh cilantro, rosemary. I'll probably end up doing this in the morning time. Some lime, pico, low collagen infused spring water, diced onions. I got the lime juice. I kind of want to try this now. Let's see. Ooh. Given ginger ale, it doesn't even have that lime taste. So thank God I got this fresh, pure Santa Cruz lime juice to add in the mocktail. And then I got two spring waters. I want us to try out this Three Trees vanilla bean almond milk. And then I got a big feed. I didn't go to the store in my pajamas. I just... People was already looking at me crazy because of my eye. But it's, like I said, they're getting better. It's, it's a good one. Oh, I took that five you. I do that three more times again. I testify for you. I thought I like you that. I do it all and I'm on run, just kidding you, I'm not As long as you joking, now it's the me, I ain't got it I've been scheming, fluid, I ain't your body As long as you dreaming about me, ain't no problem I don't got nobody just with you right now The truth, I look better under you I feel lost when I'm with you My kitchen smells so good. That beauty and stuff, I cannot wait to try that. But right now we're gonna try to make a mocktail. I really don't know how this is gonna turn out for real because I really don't have all the ingredients. I'm really just making something. And I do wanna put my beauty elixir in it for flavor. Cause this stuff, honestly, it tastes good. And I just had one, one to two packs a day, um, just for hydration. And it's the same thing that I just did, but we're gonna add the lime juice. 
the sparkling water and then this lime juice do one shot of orange juice one shot of the santa cruz lime juice um i should have got some mint leaves i don't want it to taste like a mojito It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. Ooh, ooh. Taste test. Mmm, it's actually really good. Oh wow. Mmm, that's fire. Like I'm not even kidding. Just because I made it, it's actually so good. Fire. So y'all, I woke up, was cleaning my house for a little bit, and, and look at this surprise I got. <clears throat> I told y'all, I've been having a rough past couple days, and my boo came through for your girl. And I love a chocolate covered strawberries on that time of the month, and he already knows that I was having a rough couple days, so he surprised me. It's literally the little things. I literally busted out crying. But, yeah. Anyways, I'm just cleaning up. I would show y'all my face, but I look horrendous. <laughs> but I'm just getting ready for the day. I'm just cleaning out my dishwasher and putting away my dishes that he also brought me. A matcha. And, oh my God, y'all, I was going to make my own matcha this morning. But my matcha is expired. So I'm going to get a new one and also I really want to organize. This cabinet is organized with my mugs right here but down here is where the mess is. Like I have my vitamin C, Peak Life, my um, electrolytes and my greens back there but I do want to put them in this drawer. Some way, somehow I want to make this like my wellness drawer because I already have my Peak Life um, beauty elixirs up here. So I kind of want to put them on a side so it's just like grab and go type of thing. Um, and I also don't even use these straws. So I'm, I'm going to figure out something so I can have my packs of um, my like wellness stuff up here. So I can just grab it instead of reaching all the way down here. But anyways, we got a nail cleaner today as well. But I'm just going to finish cleaning my dishes. Hey y'all, I can't even see y'all right now, but I'm about to put 
a new pair of contacts in my eye looks so much better i am gonna go get my nails done and i'm going to tim but i'm really debating because i asked dallas does she have an appointment because this year i do want to start doing my own hair as far as washing my hair but if she could style it for me that would be great so i'm waiting on her to text me back but if not i can just come back and do my own hair but i want to just wash I should just take a quick shower and then come back and wash it because I don't want to go up in there looking a mess. Wow. I feel like me again. Contacts are back in. I just want to do like a self-care day, getting myself together. I may be going to get drinks with new people today, but I'm not sure of the vibes. I'm waiting on them to... Um, give me the details because they invited me to drink so um we'll see uh, you know maybe get prepared for that my hair is getting so much thicker but we need to work on growth um i do like like i said i like putting rosemary in my hair and i am gonna wash my hair with the ogx collagen and then also the apple g as well and then we're gonna do a hair mask don't dare don't repair it repair it by briogeo and also the olaplex moisture mask i'm gonna mix it but i need and also i need to go get some new more hair fills um but yeah i'm really not sure what i want to do right now because i don't want to go in that nail shop looking crazy i don't want to wear a bonnet i'm just gonna take the last of this rosemary spray and just spray it on this add the oil the miel oil i really think this is helping me because obviously it has rosemary and I have two. Do I have two? Yeah, I have one in my travel bag and then one house. I'm gonna just let this sit during my nail appointment and then come back and rinse it out and then wash my hair and then get in the shower. I'm almost off of my menstrual. It's like towards the end. So I'm gonna show y'all what um wash I've been liking too when we get in the shower because I feel like balancing our ph is so important nobody wants to smell like after period <laughs> at least i don't really wasn't a wash girl i never used honey pot um and i think i did one time like a long time ago and it just didn't work out for me um my hoop pot is very sensitive she's very sensitive So I'm going to use this little baby. Look at the little arms. And then I'm just going to massage my scalp. And also my last hair appointment, Dallas was like, oh my God, your hair is getting so thick and long. And I was like, ah, oh, yes. So I just really want to keep up with my hair routine and stuff like that um, for this year because my hair journey has been so weird. But I'm just trying to get a hang of it. I'm trying to get a hang of a lot of things um, this year. When I get my period, I get hit hard and I get hormonal acne. I have a breakout right here. I woke up with it. Disgusting. So we're going to do this in this free for cleansing clay mask. This is going to be my second time using this. So I kind of want to see like how good it is. So I'm going to really pay attention. Sometimes I just be doing a random mask when I don't even need it. And I really don't know how good it works. But we're going to see today. When I do a clay mask, I really like to do a thin layer because sometimes if I do it too thick, my skin can get irritated because less is more. Just because you're putting a lot of product doesn't mean it's going to do extra work. And I like the way this mask smells. It smells like clean. Hmm. I just hopped up the shower and I rinsed off that mask. This definitely helps because it was hurting at first, but now it's it's gone down. So that mask will be linked down below. 
um and my girl morgan she was the one i already wanted this but she works she works at sephora in um lennox and i was like i need a new face mask and then she put me on that one i was like that's so crazy because i wanted to try that one out so shout out to her and she does like the whole sephora suggestions on her tiktok so make sure y'all check her out y'all probably seen her on your free page but, but anyways so let me get ready and i cannot wait to get my nails done so let's go you can't even sit in peace With all of these niggas be on you I'm just saying I can be The yeah. one that you call and you talk to Girl I'll share my world with you If you wanna waste your time super cute but i do want to exfoliate my hands i stopped at diptyque because i needed some new candles and i got a new room spray this is the fig um i got it from my living room area it's one of my favorite uh scents at diptyque so if you like that woody musky scent try this one out i don't know why my lighting is ugly and then i just got a new 34 candle i just like this for decoration honestly my other one went out it's kind of black in there so i'm like you know what let me just get a fresh one to put on my pink book i need a new rug i'm tired of looking at that it just doesn't go with the vibes and also she put a few samples in here uh there's gonna be a new fragrance coming out in march so let me see oh the paper This reminds me of something. I like this. I'm gonna just go ahead and get ready. I don't really know what's going on tonight. So I really just wanna just be prepared. I wanna do my hair. I wanna exfoliate. I just want to, you know, get myself together. So, and I did stop and get a matcha. It's seven o'clock. I have no plans yet. So I'm gonna take my time. I'm feeling a little better. So I'll see y'all in a second. Good morning everyone we are on our way to cycle bar this is my form of self-care self-care isn't just you know going to get your nails done facials and things like that it's about really taking care of your body because you get one body and when i go to cycle bar i feel like i'm the king of the world yes king not queen king it's so hard it's so challenging but it's hip-hop sunday the playlist is already going to be lit the class is packed i literally got the last slot so i'm just drinking Excelsius. but i need to figure i think i want to drink like coffee 
as a pre-workout i really don't want to drink this celsius because i've heard too many things class starts at 10 15 we are on time and last night i didn't finish my hair because i was like you know what let me just let the mask sit in my hair i'm not going anywhere so i ended up not going out for drinks <laughs> so that's fine but anyway so yeah i just let the mask sit overnight so i'm gonna go home and wash it out after it's obviously just made more sense because i'm about to sweat anyways and might as well just wait it out so and i'm looking like Barney. I thought this purple was gonna match the purple I already had, but it's probably faded. See, I, I look like fucking Barney. so i was number six out of 30 in this class so applaud me and i'm getting so much better and i feel so much stronger and yeah i just love cycle bar Here. Uh, you know you have a Starbucks addiction when they already know your order. Is somebody in this car though? Y'all, Hip Hop Sunday was so good. It was lit. Am I? Oh, is somebody in that car? But yeah, Hip Hop Sunday was so good. It was lit. And then I stopped at Trader Joe's because I needed to get um, some like Brussels sprouts, vegetables for the week. And some apples and stuff for like my green juice. And just like little groceries for like out the week. NT is having a tailgate at Atlantic Station. But um, because y'all know Rihanna is performing halftime. And y'all know it's like her comeback season. Hey girl. Hair still hanging in there strong. It is. <laughs> I knew it was good when I heard the shot. I'm like in a five sugar cookie. Like, Period. <laughs> Gotta have a sugar free. <laughs> Thank oh, you, boo. Monday. You too. Happy Sunday. Um, but yeah, she's making her comeback. She's having a... Um, also, I got matcha from Trader Joe's too because I need to start making my own sh stuff at home. I'm really not a football girl. The only stuff I like... If it's like a football party or something, yes, I'm absolutely going for the food. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't seen anybody really talk about it, like going or anything like that. Maybe I might stop by for like a second um after i do my hair maybe yeah i'm also just go inside take a shower rinse out my hair and then start my hair because i didn't get a chance to yesterday So it was time to take my cup out because my period was over and I'm telling y'all I love my menstrual cup. So I seen this tweet the other day and this girl was saying that she has her period for 7 to 12 days or something like that. It's because people are wearing pads or maybe tampons that contain chemicals or toxins that are causing vaginal disruptions. She, our coochie, isn't supposed to be smelling like roses and flowers. So when we get these items that, you know, contain these chemicals that's supposed to make us feel and smell fresh all day, no, you're not supposed to smell like roses and flowers. So I would look into something that is more natural and, you know, what works for you and my cup works well for me um it helps with the duration of my period i'm literally on my period three to four days tops y'all know it goes through that dr pepper phase so it i have to let it clear out but other than that i've had no issues with this it helps with cramps and i'm not telling you to go get this but this is what works for me but i would definitely work look into something that works for you if that was just some information that i've been researching especially with using my cup because i've seen such a huge difference and i'm like wow this is crazy like from transitioning from pads to a cup has really made a overall difference that i've noticed so 
um look into it see what works for you but yeah enjoy
don't y'all hate when your food just magically disappeared and there, and then you be like, ain't no way I ate it that damn bad. Ain't no way, boy. <laughs> So I just did my nighttime skincare. We're all oiled up. And I have some more eye patches on because I have the Chanel one still. So I want to use them up. And y'all, why did I get this mochi from Trader Joe's? It's actually really good. So I got the strawberry one. I really am not a mochi girl. Oh, it melted but i only like them hard i need to put this back in the freezer but they melt fast mm. but i like mine's a little bit more hard so these need to go back in the fridge but the freezer but they're so good 
Hey girl, so today I am getting prepared to go out the house and go to the coffee shop. And y'all, look at this sweatsuit. It's from Skims. Ah, it's from their new bubblegum drop. I love this. It'll be linked down below. And also I have on the halter tank top underneath. Um, just in case I get hot um, while wearing this, while I'm doing my coffee. But currently, babes, we did our own eyelash. So I'm about to just add one more in my inner corner. Um, I'm using this Kev by Kev Kev Creative Lashes Your Way. Um, I'm using 14 on my 16 on my ends, and I'm going in with 14 and then a 10. Um, but yeah, this was very like this is very like uh tedious because if you don't do it right or don't have a good technique, it'll keep just falling off um but yeah so i kind of got the hang of it and i'll do like a full tutorial um later on but i'm just gonna add one and i'm also gonna let y'all know how these lasted on me because i don't know how long this is gonna last on my eyelash and also how um good it will take when i get in the shower or like wash my face or if it gets around water um where is the glue so it has a glue with it. I don't know where it's at, but I'm just, oh, here we go. Ugh. And anything that I always mention will be linked down below. Hairstylist, locations of things, anything that y'all see me doing in vlogs, it'll be linked down below. Um, y'all ask me all the time what things are when it's linked down below. I'm like, oh my God. But, um, yeah, so I'm just adding this lash glue. It's black. And then I put just one thin layer on where I want to put it. And then I'm also going to put a thin layer on the lash. This is so convenient. I don't know why I didn't do this sooner. So I'm gonna let that tip for 10 seconds. And you wanna put it on your lash, not your skin, if that makes sense. But like I said before, I gotta get the hang of this first before I even tell y'all that. I'm like, you gotta put it on a lash like an expert, and I'm not. <laughs> but I will be. Oh, see it. And I gotta get new tweezers because these are just a mess. So here's the lash. You can see. And I'll just suck it right here. I'm hungry. I need to go. Okay, so I'm just gonna let that dry. And then I also had ordered a lash up I set a while ago, like like months ago. And I'm just gonna use the bonder on this. But yeah, so cute. I feel so pretty today. Um, and I think I'm gonna do these two mixed together today. The Mugler mixed with the Miss Dior. So I actually wasn't able to end off the vlog because I was rushing, trying to get to the coffee shop to turn in my video. And I just want to let you guys know that if you're somebody who gets your mental cycle, you get so many emotions, I feel you, girl. And just know you are not missing out on anything when you're 
tending to your mental health, tending to how your body feels, and you are not missing out when you're taking care of yourself. So I just want you to know that I am here with you, sis, and I can definitely relate. So with that being said, I'm ending off this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I love y'all so, 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 so much. And I'll see y'all in the next video.